Hey everybody, this is Gretchen the Green Lady. I'm sitting here in my garden. But you know what? I'm here today to encourage you that you need to get ready for your fall garden. I know, I know, fall garden? Well, it's still August, but we need to get things ready and planned out to put in there. It's, it's been a rough summer. I've been dealing with rust and you know, our gardens have taken a toll and it's been pretty wet here in the south and very hot here in the south. But you can still think about gardening into the fall season here in the south. We can go at least till the end of October and with some of our crops we can go into the winter. So let me give you a list of some of those things. And of course it will vary and change depending on your area and your growing zones. You can grow turnips. What about cabbage? Cabbage loves cool cold weather. Snap peas, spinach, another great cool weather crop. You can grow lettuces. Remember I did that little clip on what it's like to have bitter lettuce because of the heat. Well, we don't want to repeat that again. We don't want any more bitter lettuce. And some of the lettuces that are good for the cold are something called a winter marvel and the new red fire. Also, you could grow onions and, or shallots, spring onions. They love the cold and you can actually winter those over. Asparagus, that is for the pretty uh, aggressive gardener. You have to be willing to wait on that. It can take more than a year for you to get uh, an asparagus stem, but now beans, something called a broad bean. Carrots, beets, kale, and collards. All of those are great things to grow in your fall slash almost winter garden, depending on the length of your growing season. So I just wanted to encourage you to go ahead and get that ready, get it planned out, and to go green. And if you like what you see on here, go ahead and subscribe to my YouTube. Don't forget to like and comment and share. And go ahead and look on my Facebook page as well. Give me some ideas, give me some suggestions of things you'd like me to research or discuss with you. So this has been Gretchen the Green Lady saying go green.